I know a lot of you are planning on doing the big BBQ for Memorial Day, right? Well, we've got some great tips for you. We have Derek Marceau in the house, actually back on the patio here, and we've got some great stuff we're grilling up here. Let's see what we're working on in the big green egg. Look at that. Boom. What do we got? Right now we've got our Imperial Valley carne asada. Mm. It's our award-winning carne asada. These are USDA prime ribeyes, black Angus cattle, um, some of the best you can get. We uh, really focus on just getting high-quality stuff. High-quality beef is what it's yeah. all about. Yeah. I noticed these uh, these steaks aren't right on the grill. They're on this like little little plate here. What's yeah, so what we use are there? grill grates. That okay. way, so you can, when we have grill grates, gives you this handy spatula you can come right oh, underneath look at that. that you get right so underneath you lift, there you can lift straight up you don't have to worry oh, about oh that's very convenient and you get those perfect grill marks that mm. everyone looks looks for and it works really really good for uh fish okay you know a lot of times people will do fish and it kind of crumbles it crumble it. yeah you but don't want to lose that in the grill right right that's underneath it stuff. pick it right up it, it works out great what should you be looking for in the cut of beef so you want to that's a challenge a lot of a lot of people yeah. are faced with when they get to the grocery store or whatever i mean what are some of the secrets to the pros? I mean, I, I like to tell everyone you want to go USDA choice or higher. Okay. Um, we work for Black Angus cattle. Okay. That's, that's what we. What does the choice mean? Uh, it grades at the top 20% of all beef. Okay. So the marbling, the pH balance in the rib sections, really high. So it's going to have a lot more uh, inner muscle marbling, a lot more juicy, a lot more flavor. That's where it's at. You said the M word, the yeah, marble. That's, that's what it's all about, right? Because right? sure. I'm a big fan of a good ribeye. Right. You know, a lot of people talk up the filet mignon, and there's not much, not much marbling to that. Right. I'd much rather have a, a big juicy ribeye. Yeah, the ribeye, the spinalis muscle on the outside is probably my favorite muscle on the whole cattle. Okay. It's uh, very, very tender, very juicy, and you can get it on the very outside right here on this ribeye. Obviously, towards, towards here, here in San Diego, we have a lot of people who love their, their carne asada. Yeah. Um, what should you look for? What, what, what makes a good cut? There? We use USDA flat meat, USDA okay. prime flat meat. As you can see, it's a very absorbent piece of meat. Yeah, look at that. Nice it's and tender, a, isn't and it? It's juicy. We uh, really focus on making sure that we're using a good cut of meat because a lot of people will use a lesser quality it's a little more chewy mm -hmm. this is a little more expensive but it's uh, definitely worth it because it absorbs all the flavors and and the the big green egg here you're a big fan of that I'm a huge huge fan of big and green egg. and what's the reason versus just your typical you know square grill or? they're just so versatile you can do so many different things with big green egg and they hold temperature really well so the Komoda grills themselves mm -hmm. the ceramic it just holds temperature really well you can smoke at a low temperature you can get it really hot like we're getting it right now so you can see the flavor Flames are nice and, and warm, and you can grill your carne asadas, but you can also put a pork butt on there and, and smoke it, so it, it works out both ways. The art of searing. Yeah. Let's talk about that a moment. Yeah, so you, we do a reverse here. So we do tri-tip a lot of times. So we'll smoke our tri-tip for about okay. two, two hours. We take it off, get the grill really, really hot, as hot as you can get it, and then we sear it at the very end to kind of lock in all those juices. Valley Farm Market, what, what, what's the favorite thing that you guys serve up there? I mean, everything's uh, good, I man, know. What? Our pokey's really, the really taking good. off. Um, carne asada, pollo asada, ribeyes. Our meats are, are definitely the ones what people come for. Whenever I buy a larger steak that I'm used to, and I don't know the timing on it, I'm always I always want to cut in cut into it to check. Sure. Probably not advisable, right? My, my favorite thing to tell people is you want to think about 86 when you're done. You're 86. Eight minutes on one side, six minutes on the other. It's done. That's it. Sure. God, we have more tips coming our way here, coming up here on the CW. So stick around, Derek. Thanks so much. I appreciate, appreciate it. it. This is the, the the big day, the big kickoff to summer. Everyone's out grilling and yeah. And it's, happy Memorial Day to everyone. Happy Memorial Day for sure. All right, Heather, we'll send it back to you, and uh, I might be doing some sampling out here if you know what I mean. Well, then you better bring some in. You I don't will. want to eat for alone. Sure, for sure. We're well, very sharing on this Memorial Day. Yeah. Sharing is caring. Yeah, that's All right. right. Sharing things. Sure.